Stand by, 4-4. Delta 8-2, Delta 8-2, come in. Delta 8-2, come in. Delta 8-2, report. Delta 4-4, no response from 8-2. Please proceed inside to confirm 8-2 status. 10-4 dispatch. Welcome back to Let's Play Batman Arkham Origins with me, Squawk. And when we left off, uh, there was a, like, a big crime scene that didn't really lead anywhere, to be honest. It just kind of led us to the revelation that someone had been murdering a lot of people, Black Mask didn't die, and so look, it was a very confusing murder scene, and I'm not really interested in thinking about it. But all it told us is that there's some dude in town called the Joker, no idea who that Joker is, and then... We need to go back to the Batcave to pick up some boxing gloves because we're going to go foolishly hack the police service now because... Eh, why not? Apparently Batman needs some information from him and asking politely just doesn't work anymore. So we need to head back to the Batcave which means we need to pick up our Batwing which is nearby. I mean, there we go. We'll just... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Look, we could just always... You could have dropped me off at the back cave, you stupid plane. Right. Just land just land here, Batman, and then we'll get the bat plane to pick you up properly this time. I want to go back to the back cave. Come on. Right. Just drop me off here at the back cave. Like, where do I go to get dropped off? I mean, what seriously, how do I get dropped off at the back cave again? Like, is it comms tower? I don't know. I mean, I just wanna I just wanna go here. I just wanna go here. Oh, there we go. Back there we go. You just have to click on the correct part of the back cave to go back to the back cave. It's very specific. I don't like how the back plane looks, by the way. It looks kind of ugly to me. I think it looked better in Batman Arkham City. Here it just looks like it's only like half a plane. Like really, it's like it's like it's like a very stubby plane. I mean, it's only a one-man plane. He's gonna be carrying missiles and shit, but I don't know. The plane just doesn't Welcome look home, cool sir. to me. The concussion detonator is on your workbench. Remember, if you use that instead of your fists, you'll do less lasting damage to those police officers and civil servants. So they're just, so they're just like the super soft boxing gloves, then, like made out of tissues, then. Yeah, it works for me. What's about suit? Oh wait, what's this do? Choose your costume. I'll have the Batman costume, please. Thank you very much. That was thrilling. Right, where did you put my where did you put my boxing gloves, Alfred? Because I didn't listen to a word you said, by the way. Hello, Alfred. Thanks for just sh pushing me out of the way. Um, Alfred, where did you put them? Well played, sir. You stopped the electrocutioner with a single strike. Well, I, I did use his arrogance to my advantage. A textbook move a child could have avoided. True. But I doubt the rest of them will go down as easily. Oh yeah, Deathstroke took ages. Be eating that Christmas ham sooner than you think. What's with Americans and ham? They like ham, don't they? But is it like, isn't it? Says what's a ham? I need to find out what a ham is in American terms, right? Now, where? Ah, thank you. There's my concussion detonator. They don't look like boxing gloves, but I'm assuming they do something useful. No description, it just looks cool, right. I'm guessing I just throw it at a policeman and then it just it just like does something useful. I mean where where is my concussion detonator? It is here. So I'm guessing I'm not allowed to throw it at Alfred because that's just really, really cruel, so I'll catch you later, Alfred. I'm off to um where where's the police station? It's all the way back in the industrial district. Yeah, it's all the way in Burnley. I can't, I can't fast travel. Oh no, I can fast travel to Coventry, which is near it. Cool. All right, we're already on our way. Right, fast travel there, and then we can just go to a police station and solve a crime. Actually, I just realised what that looks like. It looks like the tumbler, but without wheels. Which was still quite ugly. I mean, I just don't like that seat. The seat is ugly. I mean, seriously, the seat, it just doesn't look cool. It doesn't look comfortable. When I want to fly a plane, I want to be comfortable. I mean, that's just a problem with the uh, thing for me. But anyway, enough morning. We're back in Coventry. Let's glide our way to that police station now, eh? 
Where is it? Well, it's up here, isn't it? Um, better keep an eye out for henchmen, by the way. Not that I'm sure there are many. There's Joker's house, by the way. Joker's tower, whatever you want to call it. Place where there's just crimes happening. And here's Mount Doom again. Seriously, what is going on with this place? That is like, seriously, that is like fucking Mount Doom. Or at least it's the Blackgate. Is that Blackgate Prison? What is it with Gotham just making everything so really, really over the top in this area? I will never know. Right, what direction should I be heading in, by the way? This direction. It's on the other side of fucking Mount Doom here, right? Let's get going, Batman. Let's just get going. Just glide past it. Let's just pretend a big nasty structure doesn't exist. Now we're in Burnley, which is a team that isn't doing very well in English Premier League football, by the way. I tell it live. We're actually doing decent, but I wish Middlesbrough was doing better than Burnley because, yeah. Now, how does one get in a GCPD, by the way, when it's covered in armed guards, like all police stations are? Okay, so we need to find a way in that doesn't really get me noticed. I can do that when the police have snipers everywhere. Um, what does a... Right, fine, a concussion detonator on you then, my friend. Right, that just made him fire his gun loads. So I don't. This is officially janky. Yes, it is janky. Cause that, that was absolutely, completely, and totally useless. Yeah, I am long gone. Right, just knock him out. Uh, actually, no, it's not looking right. Can I go in here? No, I can't. Right. Sorry, sorry, mate, but I have to do this. Shh. Right. Hopefully, no one will notice that the sniper just got knocked out. But right. I want to be in there, and to be honest, I'm just going to take out all the cops anyway. I don't care if it means patrols are doubled and stuff. Just take them all out, then we'll just we'll get in somehow. Simple as that. I'll just have to be really, really good at dodging, because as far as I can tell, the concussion blaster just makes cops go a little bit loopy. I mean, let's throw another one, actually, because they are kind of fun. I mean, there we go. Just throw that one. What's going to happen to you now? Yeah, it just makes them go mad. Yeah, it's kind of fun. Yeah, you're looking at the wrong gargoyle, by the way, mate. I'm on the other gargoyle, right next to it. Wasted time. Yeah, waste of time. Hold the door. Yes, you are holding the door. I want to be in that door. How do I get you two out of the way? That is the question. Well, I could probably glide up onto here. Not noticed, somehow. Thank you very much. No, I just need to get past you two. How I do that, I have no idea about finding some way of distracting you. Maybe with like a large beach ball or something. This isn't going to be easy, is it? Right. Get yourself back on that gargoyle. Let's think of a new strategy, because I need I, I need to be up on here. You lot, you lot don't have assignments. You lot can go and do that crime scene, please. I mean, go on. You guys like to do crimes, right? Please? This isn't going to work, is it? Right. He's on his own. He's on... Actually, yeah, there's someone over there. You're on your own, aren't you, mate? Right, you're next. It's gonna hurt me more than it's gonna hurt you, dude. Just kidding, it won't hurt my conscience one little bit. I hate all of you GCPD people. This is just for making me glide across that really long bridge because you guys just couldn't be bothered unblocking it and just you just let fucks just put crime blocks all over it. You guys are really bad at your jobs. You're letting me walk right all over you. Should I throw another concussion detonator by the way just to be a troll? Yes, I should, of course, right. I know, throw two concussion detonators. There we go. I, I can only throw one at a time. Shh, I didn't do anything. Ah, oh, damn it. I'm not here. Leave me alone. Right, I think they've forgotten about my existence. But right. Using the concussion detonator, just... Ah, oh, damn it, he knows I'm there. Or not. No, you haven't got anything. You're just being stupid, right. So, as far as I can tell, the concussion detonator is just absolutely useless. That's all I can tell from this stupid bloody device. It's just absolute shit. There's going to have to be another strategy used in this one. I mean, I could use explosive gel, batarang. Yeah, I should be using batarang because, I mean, I've got those batarang. Hey, I could use a remote claw, actually. Can that do anything? I could pull these two guys together. That would be really funny. So, there you go. You. There you go. 
That somehow worked. I should have done that earlier. Right. Those two... Oh, no, wait, they just got back up. Damn it. Right. Maybe if I do it really... Maybe if I do it really fast when he's not looking, I could just walk right in. Yeah. Right, you two get glued together. There you go. Right. Just let me in, please. Oh, Batman, for fuck's sake. I just wanted to go in the door, not climb all over it. Now I've got to do it again. It's all right. These guys aren't as smart as Deathstroke. These guys will fall for it 16 times in a row. Right, you just go where, you just go where, you two fall for it again. It's like, it's like this really annoying prank where you just tie someone's shoes together, isn't it? And it somehow keeps working. Go on, go where, go where, go where, go where. Just go a little bit further, my dude, please. And Batman, this time open the door. Don't climb all over the door, because I just want to go in the door. It's not that hard, right? Come on. Move, 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 move. Right. There we go. Alright. Ah, oh, shit. He's going to see me. I just want to go in the door. Ah, oh, damn it. Secure the area to come in. Right. Um, drop a smut pellet. See you later. <laughs> right. So I actually need to kill all these guys in order to get in anywhere. So that all that strategy was for absolutely nothing. But at least I know that I can use this to bring two guys down at once, which might actually be quite useful. I'm just gliding over here because I'm saying I can, by the way. There's actually this thing over here. It's not useful, but... Yeah, I just wanted to sit on it for a minute. Right, um... How are we going to go around doing this one, then? This one's quite hard. You know, this is actually probably the strongest part of the game, by the way. These predator sequences are quite challenging. A lot of thinking outside the box to be done. Especially now that I've basically got no health left as well, which is actually means if I get caught one more time, it's Batman bye-bye time. And all these guys are just standing in one big clump now. Hmm. Well, my smoke pellet's nearly cooled down. If I throw a smoke pellet at a cop, I could probably dive in and take one out, actually. That'd be a good idea. I'll throw a concussion detonator at one of them. Yeah, that'd be a good idea. Right. Oh, no, Batman! No, no, no! That was close. Nearly bugged it up again, didn't you, Batman? Right. This guy's coming. We could take this guy out because he's isolated. Just keep coming closer, my dude. Come on. Yeah, just peek around the corner. You don't need to fire your gun, by the way, when you jump around. Thank you. Right, just keep coming closer, and then I can take you out, and then everyone can be happy, please. Come on, come on. He isn't coming around properly. Right, shh. Right, that didn't work. Better try again. Hello there, policeman. Not much to look at from up close. Don't know why everyone was so afraid of him. I don't know either. This guy isn't really working for me. <sighs> right, right. Now we know at least that we need to... Well... Target better. As in, we need to kill all the policemen. Well, we don't need to kill them all, of course. Yes, I know. You'll need to find a way to sneak in that won't attract attention. Otherwise, you'll never make it to the server room. Understood. Thanks. Right, so all we got to do is knock out all the policemen, and then we can get him. Well, first things first, we'll take out the sniper. He's the big problem to deal with. Not really. He's just the easiest one to deal with. So there we go. Right, and oh yeah, by the way, look. All the cops are corrupt, by the way, and a Christmas tree broken. Or something like that. Right. He's next. He's isolated. Oh, shit. Don't look up. Don't look up. He's a nice guy, that cop. He's a good kid, right? Jump down and finish him off. Right. Thank you. Right. Who's next on my list? Even though no one's wearing heartbeat sensors, suicide collars, or anything that's going to get me caught just yet, which is always still good for me. He's next. See, now, now that I haven't decided to blow all my cover up by using concussion-y concussion things, this is just going nice and easy. Already not that many to go, and none of them are on the door either. We haven't got those two guys on the door, but now I, I am probably going to get, well, not discovered, but people are about to become aware that there might be a bat problem. I don't know it. Alright. You just stay there, my friend. You just stay there. Because this guy's next. Alright, he's not looking. Sneak, 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 sneak. Right. Make this one quick because he's going to turn around. Come on. Right, get out of here. Shh. Perfect. Right, now we're playing with stealth. Get up here. Let's plan our next move. Let's see. 
he'd be a good target to go for next, but I'm not sure if he can see him. That's the only issue I'm having with that one. It's just three of you left, and you're all quite close to together. But then again, I have a plan. Batman, glide onto here without being seen, preferably. Right, it's all right. I haven't been seen. Get a smoke bomb ready. There we go. Right, I'll have you... And then I'll just get out of here, but there you go. You just lost your one of your mates in the smoke. Perfect. <laughs> Only one of well, two of you left. Oh just oh damn it, he's moved. Right. Hang on. He's still on his own. Right. Yeah, it'll heal. This won't, however. Oh well it will. Oh shit. Right. Damn it! Batman, you are useless sometimes. Alright, take him out quickly and then finish him off. Right. Backlot. Oh, fuck, Batman, you are so bad with that back clock. Right, take him out. Sorry I had to punch you. I know Alfred didn't go to approve, but yeah. Right, let's get in, break into the police station, also get a level up. Right, get a new bloody predator thing going, because we did not... Well, we did we did better that time, but we need more stuff. Let's see. More batter... Oh, what's this? Rope takedown. Learn two new takedown techniques from the rope. The tightrope takedown... And, right, we can just take people down from the zip line and the tightrope then, so... Let's see, when, so, when supply over, over and over, and then you press Y, and then, yeah, you can just basically, basically I can do uh, an inverted takedown wherever I want now, and I am happy about that. Let's go in and see what we can do, get some data which we need on that Joker. Also, we'll probably use a concussive blast thing, by the way, even though this thing is absolutely useless, as far as I can see, but right. We are in the GCPD. It looks absolute trash as per usual. By the way, earn it. Join the GCPD. Let's see. If we keep going downstairs, there's apparently some hostiles nearby. But for, but everyone's hostile to Batman, aren't they? This door will be locked because you apparently have to keep it locked. So blow up this wall and then we'll just get hurt. But hey, the cops won't care because explosions seem to happen all the time in Gotham bloody city. Yeah, what did you hear? water pipe bursting. I'd love to go take a look, but, you know, my shift's over. Loeb. Loeb understood. The problem is Gordon ain't a team. This won't be easy. Yep. Yeah. But if I'm going to access the National Criminal Database and find out what happened at Lacey Towers, I need to find the server room without being discovered. This is like a, like a not very good adaptation of Batman Year Zero, isn't it? Where Batman was, like, just becoming Batman and then it turned out that Commissioner Loeb was... Oh, about the there's Commissioner Gordon. But Commissioner Loeb was just a big corrupt asshole and Gordon played by the rules and yeah, he didn't like taking bribes and shit, so yeah. And yeah, I went deathstroke somewhere. Hi Gordon! There's eight assassins in town tonight. Well, From six. We've been gathering, they're among the most dangerous criminals on record. Period. After interrogating Wayland Jones, we've learned that they're all competing for a huge bounty, which Black Mask has offered for the head of the bat. Where do I sign up? <laughs> I thought he was a ghost. Hmm. Why does everyone talk shit about me? Yeah, well, they were supposed to be guarding oh, the crime hi. scene, not Gavin. No wonder the bat got the drop on him. Yeah, tell them to keep their eyes open. Yeah, whatever. Go down, you corrupt person. Thank you and good night. Right. Must you be so brutal, sir? These are city employees. They're corrupt. As corrupt as they come, and they're in my way. See, Anarchy's probably doing the right thing right now. You never know when you might need their help. At any rate, your objective is the GCPD server room. I've marked it on your map. Thank you, Alfred. Right, by the way, there's Vincent Falcone on a thing. And these guys are up to something you... Oh, he hates the homeless. They're watching hobo fights, aren't they? I love the GCPD. And there's loads of cops in there. Right, I could probably sneak in while they're just watching their Herber fights. Uh, ah, just fuck it, take them out. Right, just get wrecked. Ow. Right, take them out. Right, no more Herber fights for you. That's what you were watching. What are you watching? Yeah, Herber fights. GCPD. To protect and serve and just be generally douchey. Right, he's next. Oh, the door's locked. Right, I better not get noticed for that. No, I didn't, right? What if I just jump through the window? That would work. But then again, that would be stupid. Hi, guys. Hey, it is a hobo. I dumped in clean three days. Like they said, things swooped down out of nowhere. 
Huge wings and claws. They're like bloody dodging. Right, I'm enough here. I've had enough here about myself and indulge my ego. Let's go through here. This is takes us to the locker room and it's locked, isn't it? Right. Hmm. I won't what about be able to access thing? doors like this with my cryptographic sequencer. I'll need to find another way. Right, well, how does one force a door then? Well, he finds some yes, keys yes, or he just dives through a window like this. Now, let's go. That went well. So I'm guessing these windows can't be dived through either. No, they cannot. Right. Could always throw a TV at them. Uh, I don't know. Blow up these electronics. That might work. I mean, these electronics just look like garbage, so... No, it didn't work. Right, what about using that new device we unlocked then? What about using the remote claw? Mm, oh, hello there, little vent. Right, vent it is. Right, get that back claw down here, my friend, and we will find our new way in. Right, in the vents we go, where Batman rightfully lives. Hello, you guys. I'm not very fond of you for beating up herbos. It's, it's not cool. Against that many armed men, I can use Deathstroke's remote claw to pass above their heads undetected. Yes, you can, it provided we don't hear you firing the bloody thing. But fine. Right. There we go. All oh, right. Well done, you. If any of us can kill the bat before the assassins get to him, we get the bounty, all fifty million dollars. Oh, thank you, policemen. Yes, you do all retire early. <sighs> what are we waiting for? GCPD to protect and fucking serve. Yeah. No coffee for you. Just sleepy time. Right. Let's see reception next, probably. Just going to reception like a normal. Ah, oh, damn! I can't go in. Right, but it's all right. This one actually has a cryptography locky thing with the word of the day. Right. What's today's word? Let's see. It's. Servip Rotex. Server Protect. Right, thank you very much. Now let's go into reception. I would like to report a crime, guys. You guys all suck. Find dirt. Make our own. I'm what if By the way, use remote claw to launch a fire extinguisher towards the officers. That sounds fun. You mean boom. And now I can take you all out. Simple as that, right? Get wrecked, guys, and then none of you are getting your 50 million, by the way, because I'm going to do this combat sequence properly and not die, so no 50 million for you. Tough luck to you guys, unfortunately. Tough as luck. Right. We're nearly done with these cops who are all corrupt and shitty. There we go. It's nice to be a policeman once in a while, especially Grand Theft Batman now. Right. Let's see. Oh, dear. Yeah, I'll pay my respects later to Commissioner Love, even though the comics wrote him out as a massive asshole. Let's go into the yes investigation room, or interrogation room. So what does this hmm. disruptor of yours do? Little okay. bit of this, little bit of that. Mostly, though, it does a whole lot of none of your damn business. Yeah, whatever. Oh, not you again! Yeah, hi again, Santa. Got presents? Please? I want, I want them. Talk, or you won't be walking anywhere, ever. No way! You gotta answer for dropping me off that rooftop, buddy! No, you have to answer to me. How does this disruptor work? Ask one of the pigs. They got it in evidence lockup. How about we take a little walk up to the roof? Okay. Okay, you win. It it jams weapons, overrides electronic locks, alright? Now you gotta let me go! How'd that work out for you last time? <clears throat> Well, you did technically let him go. You just dropped him. All right. Evidence locker, and then we get the disruptor. Then it sounds like, though I don't really care. By the way, there's a policeman winter ball. What is it with policemen in America and having balls? It's like their number one thing, isn't it? Right. Where am I going next? Let's see. Um, I'm here, and I probably just want to keep going downstairs. Right. I'm cool with that, so let's go in this... Oh, it's still locked, isn't it? Oh, we could probably just exit fire interrogation and through that nice little hole I made in the window. Oh, by the way, bring your popcorn and your donuts if you want to watch interrogation, because, yeah, these policemen really... These policemen really are dickheads, aren't they? Even the Christmas trees don't look good here, which is really tragic. Your buddy Anarchy? He will wipe this city clean of your filth! Yeah? To be honest, at this rate in this game, I actually do want to side with Anarchy, but I'd rather go to the reception and this... Ah, oh, fuck it, right. Can I get in? No, I can't. Right. Any of you guys have guns, by the way? No, one of you has body armor on. Well, 
What can, what use is a door, by the way? Well, I could just jump over your goddamn door. Well done, policemen, you absolute idiots. Right. Now, stop beating up hobos, or I'm going to side with anarchy and start beating up, like, bl or blowing up police buildings as well, because, to be honest, at this rate, anarchy has a better idea of what he's doing than you lot, even if he's just some sort of edge lord. but... Fuck it, he, he seems to know that the police in this city are absolute arseholes. He may not have a good approach for taking them out, but to be honest, it's, it's better than letting you guys just run around and just beat up the homeless all the time. Ass wipes, right. Come on, nearly take them all out. Just keep jumping, keep jumping. Yeah, someone hit hit me. Well, I'll just hit you. Nice double take out, by the way. Let's just break his arms. Thank you. Or just give him a big grand slam. I don't care. Suplex slam's always cool in my books. Right, there we go. Right, who's next? Who's next? Who's next? Right, you, you, then you, now you, you as well, and you get the big boo. There you go. Another suplex slam. Now you, 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 and you get a big uh, face punch. There you go. And you get the last one. You got the uppercut. You should feel thankful for that. Now then, Mr. Herb, uh, you want to have a chat? Coffee? Reported on the ground. 622 on the premises. Repeat, priority one alert. Intruder in the building. And no one on the reception, by the way. Bloody typical. Right. Oh, look, this door has slightly more defenses, so I don't care. Anyway, Get hello, Herbo. To a shelter. You kidding? That's where they round us up. Hey, you don't get it. Anarchy gets it, but you? Hey, you don't get it, man. Not as cool as Anarchy is, he is still trying to blow stuff up, which probably isn't a good thing, but then again, I don't care. Right, now where do I go? Is it out of here? Because that's probably just going to take me out into the snow, isn't it? Yeah. Hmm. Where to next, then? Or did I just save you guys for nothing? There's got to be another way out of here. Does it involve using the remote claw? No. Right. Do -do 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 um. Don't worry, I'm not going to shoot you with it. I just like walking around with it. Um. Aha! We just jumped through this thing. Oh, not. We just blow it up, actually. Batman, why can't you jump through soft wood? It's not that hard. I mean, come on. Building materials in this area are absolute wank, aren't they? Right, through here, and then through here, and then through here to the lockers. And that disruptor should be somewhere around here. I gotta deal with this problem. And who are you? I don't give this bastard what he wants. He'll send the tape to the press. Yeah, whatever. I don't care. <laughs> Corrupt as usual. Thank you very much. You shouldn't have been doing all that BDSM if you wanted to keep yourself in the clean. Right. Now, through the vent, and then we can go earn ourselves some honour and respect by probably doing a job that isn't the GCPD. Because to be honest, this, ga this game seems to have something against policemen, doesn't it? Like, it really. Oh, have we frozen? No, we had a loading screen. Barbara Gordon's nearby, by the way. Hi, guys. thinks their actions are justified. Who acts completely outside the system. The system is broken. Why is it with all the teenagers in this game being edge lords? Everything's broken. All the systems are broken. Fuck capitalists. We've got to go communist, man. By the way, the camera fucked up. The camera's obviously in on their capitalist schemes. Which is why I should probably become a communist. Anyway, Gordon's in there. Being Gordon. I'm up here. Being Batman. And I should really call this an episode at some point as well. It's probably been like 20 minutes now or something. It's been a long one. So I think I will actually call it an episode once I climb up here. And right, yeah, this is actually a good area to call it an episode. That's actually not a bad thing. You guys can go to traffic because you know what? There's roadblocks everywhere. Oh yeah, and you love this filthy little tap right? Right, first things a lot, screw all you, you guys suck, and also, goodbye everyone, because this is where I'm going to call it an episode, so I hope you've enjoyed today's episode of Let's Play Batman Arkham Origins, and I'll see you all on the next one. See you later. <laughs>